Hello and welcome to DC Plus Tutorials. We just introduced free training course on Creo Parametric 2.0. In this course we will learn about how to use the software. So this training can be good resource for who want to learn Creo software. You can join this training here. This is our fourth tutorial. So far we have discussed about these commands. I am assuming that, you already familiar with our last three tutorials on 2D Sketch. You can access by clicking here, or links mentioned in description. In this tutorial, we will discuss about normal command, and editing commands like, modify, mirror, corner, divide, delete segment, and, rotate resize command. Normal command, is used for dimensions in Sketch. Select normal command and, select any one line, and press middle button in graphics area. It will give you length of line. For angle, select normal command and select, two line with control or, command button, and press middle button. If you want this angle, then use middle mouse button too this side. Select normal command and select two parallel line. This will give you, distance between them. Same way select any two point. It will give you distance between these points. From command name, modify, you can understand about its function. Modify command is used to modify dimensions in sketch. Before use of modify command, make sure you have all required dimensions on screen. Use normal command to make new dimensions like, angle, distance or length etc. First select all dimensions and, then click on modify command. You can use scroll button or enter, exact value in box. You can see, as you change dimensions, your sketch dimensions are also changes instantly. These because, auto regenerate is on. Currently selected dimensions, will appear with, small rectangle box in sketch. So. At any point you can assure that, you are changing proper dimensions. Now remove these tick mark and enter all values. Your sketch will, regenerate after clicking OK. In complex sketch make sure to, turn off regeneration, this will reduce complexity. Now, to mirror this sketch, first draw center line. Now select sketch, and select mirror command, and then select center line. it will give you, mirrored sketch. To remove any segment of sketch, select delete segment, and select segment to be removed. Or you can also draw pattern to remove segments. Divide tool, is used to divide sketch in many segments. Select divide command and just select points. To divide the circle into three segments, click on divide tool, and make three points. Now circle converted into three segments. Now you can remove any of these segments. Corner command is works like trim command. You can trim any entity by corner command. To rotate or resize sketch, use rotate resize command from toolbar. Select entire entity and click on rotate resize command. 
enter resize factor or rotating angle, and click OK. Your all dimensions will be resize according to resize factor. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this video you also would like to see our other video. You can access by clicking here or links are given in descriptions. To receive update about upcoming videos, subscribe to our channel. We'll appreciate if you share this video, so other can take advantage of this resources.